This is the latest update on the 60 build that we got. So what I did was I took the block out. You remember it was sitting over there on the ground. It was all uh, rusty and stuff. I took it outside. I kind of scraped as much rust off that I could. I used the wire wheel. Cleaned off the block as much as I could. And then uh, took it out and I honed it. I just used a flex hone. Just a little flex hone. You can kind of see it down there. Flex hone. So I used 320 grit, uh, and it came out pretty good. You can see, I don't know if it'll zoom in really good, but you can see the cross hatch in there. And we're gonna run it. We're gonna see what it does. I had a little spot in one of the cylinders there, but we put that cross hatch back in there and hopefully uh, it doesn't pose a problem. Should be okay. But all the cylinders came out pretty good. I'm going to still take a razor blade scraper. And I'm going to just go along the block surface. Even though I cleaned the block. You know, first what I did was I, I scraped all the rust off. Then I took the whole block. I sprayed it down with engine degreaser. And let it just sit for a little while. And after I sprayed it down with engine degreaser. Power washed it really good. Then I honed it. And I washed it some more. Then I cleaned out the cylinders with... Uh, purple power degreaser and then I wiped that out when you rinse that wipe that dry then I rinsed out the cylinders rubbed them down with uh, uh, transmission fluid and then I degreased them again with the purple power and wiped it out then I rubbed them down with the white uh, microfiber cloth all the cylinders to make sure that they were pretty clean and uh, we didn't have anything on them so that's it you can see down in there so and I believe what GM calls for is a 240 to a 400 grit on the uh, honing stone or honing uh, flex hone I went with a 320 because uh, I'm running some molly rings molly rings are usually uh, 320 to 400 grit so the only thing that I wish that I had on this one that I don't have yet is a plateau brush. And uh, I'm going to end up getting one. But this is the block. It's painted like uh, I painted it with a red first and then I went over it with, uh, let me see, painted with that red down there. That's cheap. It's terrible. But then I went over it with the VHT and this color here, which is uh, red fire. Can we zoom in on that? Yeah, red fire. And this is how it came out. And it's just uh, going in the truck, so it don't matter. It don't have to be perfect. But uh, we got our parts laid out over here. So in the next couple days, week or so, I'll be putting uh, just a stock can back in it. LS1 crank, just some stock 6-0 pistons and rods. Got some ARP rod bolts, ARP head bolts. Oh, and I picked up these uh, springs. Wow, what did I do with them? Let me see if I can find them real quick for you. Well, I'll make in another video, I'll show you. Jigs sells a high pressure spring for uh, the GM oil pumps. So I picked up these high pressure springs. They're $4, $3.99. And then Jigs is doing, right now, the free shipping and handling on everything. So uh, I ordered a couple of them. But I'm going to take the pump here, which I've poured it. I don't know if you can see down in there. Let's see if we can zoom down in there. So this is just, uh, let's see if it'll focus. Yeah, there we go. This is just a stock pump. But what I'm going to do is I'm going, and I ported it. And I'm going to uh, take this screw out here, and I'm going to change the spring just to make it a high, high pressure pump. Not a high volume. Don't need high volume. It's just a regular street truck, but it'll be high pressure. And then, too, probably not necessary, but I'm going to take the pump apart, back apart here with these bolts here, and... Uh, put some assembly lube inside the pump. I know some people just like to pour oil down in the pump prior to installing everything, but I'm going to do some assembly lube and see what we can do. 
that's it this is the update and i'll uh make another video here soon let you know what my progress is